Hello, everyone. I'm Jeff Brywood alongside head coach Melissa McFerrin and coach the Elmeron Fieldhouse tonight. You will welcome another nationally ranked program as we've seen uh, in this new conference this year and one of the toughest schedules you've had since you've been here in 23rd ranked Rutgers. Absolutely. I mean, Rutgers is very, very good. Um, obviously, when you look at our schedule, everybody sees the Yukons and the Louisvilles, but everybody's just kind of skipped over Rutgers. <laughs> yeah. And as I've watched videotape of Rutgers over the last couple of weeks, they're a very good basketball team moving into the rankings this week. Um, they are a classic Vivian Stringer team. Vivian Stringer in the Hall of Fame, inducted this past year, and her team comes here with wonderful pressure. They're, Vivian is known for her full court presses. They break open games that way. They're very athletic. They're very disciplined. They are on the glass like um, we don't see many teams that get on the glass mm -hmm. like Vivian Stringer team. So they're really great and wonderful to welcome to the Fieldhouse this evening. You mentioned they're kind of flying under the radar because last year by their standards was not a very right. good year, but they're back in the top 25. But this program's not many years removed from th their final four runs. This program, I believe, has been twice. I think Vivian's yeah. taken them twice to the final four at Rutgers and, of course, took a team to the final four at Iowa, took Cheney State to the final four. I think the only coach that has taken three programs to a final four. So we're not dealing with a, a novice here right. in terms of how to build basketball teams, and they're going to put quality on the floor tonight. It should be should be a great game at the Fieldhouse tonight. They're on a pretty good roll right now with their nine-game winning streak. They are on a nine-game winning streak, and they're confident. They're still young. Um, they graduated a lot of players a year ago, and but they've got some of the most wonderful talent in the American Athletic Conference, starting with their highlight freshman of Tyler Scaife. And they've got, they've got uh, post players. They don't have a lot of depth, but they've got a great starting five that is wonderfully athletic. They are the best two-point jump shooting team that I think I've ever seen. They don't shoot a lot of threes, but they they understand what shots they want, what shots they're going to take, and they typically hit them. Tyler's getting a lot of the attention. Uh, maybe the best freshman in our league, but Kalia Copper's very well, uh, very good as well. She's leading Rutgers over 16 points a game. Kalia Copper, I said this in video with our players. She's going to remind you of Brittany Carter. I mean, she is a long, athletic. Um, can run in the lanes, finishes near the rim or maybe above the rim. A great rebounder, a great jump shooter, a great defender, and she's a. She's, she's a very nice player. And then you go to their two post players, too, that are um, Holloway and um, Laney. Very, very athletic, very skilled post players. Again, get the shots that they want. They, Holloway is going to be their best post-up player, mm -hmm. and she scores at a very high percentage around the basket. And then Laney, again, I, I always refer to Nicole Dixon because I think that puts a picture in your mind right. about a certain kind of player. But she's going to be on the trail. Maybe not a three-point shooter, but a long two-shooter. Wanders around the baseline, very athletic, can score from uh, underneath the basket you know, on reverse layups and things like that. And they are just – their their top five is very, very talented. And finally, Coach, your team's got to be excited about the opportunity coming off their first American win. We're going to battle. We, we'll have a little bit different game plan uh, against Rutgers than we've had against some teams in the American. But we are excited, and we feel like we've played three out of our four games. We feel like we've played very well. The UConn game, we didn't feel like we played as well, but we've got to give UConn some of the credit for that. So we're feeling good about ourselves, and we're going to throw a game plan, throw a game plan in there tonight that we think is going to give us a chance to win. Thanks a lot, Coach. Thanks, Jeff. It's Rutgers in Memphis, 7 o'clock at the Elmer Rowan Fieldhouse. For head coach Melissa McFerrin, I'm Jeff Brightwell on the Memphis Tiger Network.